Chelsea broke their scoring drought with a 2-0 victory over local rivals Fulham in the Premier League on Monday, thanks to goals from Mikhailo Mudrik and Armando Broja in his comeback from injury. Mauricio Pochettino's revamped and costly team had not scored in their last three league games and had only managed five goals in six league matches this season before their trip to Craven Cottage. However, they took charge of the West London Derby with two quick goals in the first half. In the 18th minute, Ukrainian winger Mudrik controlled a cross from Levi Colwill with his chest and beat goalkeeper Berend Leno with a low shot. A minute later, Broja took advantage of some sloppy defending by the hosts to double the lead. It was Mudrik's first goal since joining Chelsea nine months ago, while Broja, who replaced the suspended Nicholas Jackson, was making his first start since suffering a knee injury at the end of 2022. It's an unbelievable feeling. It's been a long time coming, Broja told Talksport about his goal. We are gelling as a team. It's not going to happen overnight. It's important for us to have that time and to keep progressing as a team. Ian Matson, who replaced Mudrick at halftime after he picked up an injury, came close to making it three for Chelsea when he hit the post in the 62nd minute, as the visitors eased to only their second league win of the season. The result lifted Chelsea to 11th place with eight points, jumping over Fulham, who are 13th, on goal difference. The performance was fantastic, too many good things, very positive things. We need to keep working, keep believing, said a relieved Pochettino. The belief was there, and the team today in the end got what we wanted. Now it's about being ruthless and working really hard and finding better solutions. Pochettino played down concerns that Broja, Moises Caicedo, and Enzo Fernandez might have suffered new injuries, with several other key players already out, but he said Mudrik had felt a problem in his thigh at the end of the first half. Fulham coach Marco Silva rued the soft goals his side had conceded to the visitors. It created a really difficult scenario for us and the perfect one for Chelsea, he said. The Portuguese dismissed suggestions his team were missing the firepower of Serbia forward Aleksandr Mitrovic, who joined Saudi club Al-Hilal in August, saying he was only focused on his current crop of players. Of course we have to keep working, Silva added. We have to be more effective. We have to decide better. Thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.